Hello, it's time for another episode of It's Not About You. We've been working through the Bible, talking about some sections of Scripture that really show us uh, even our salvation is not about us. My name is Bob Benson. I pastor Christ Lutheran Church in Greenhurst, New York, and uh, we spend some time together in the Scriptures. I I'm going to talk about a very familiar Scripture. Uh, if you've been a Christian at all, you've probably heard this story in Luke 10, verses 25 through uh, 39. Um, 37. Uh, it's the story of the Good Samaritan. But what I want to read for you is, uh, is the end of it. The Samaritan comes across this man, and he went up to him and bound his wound, pouring on oil and wine. He set him on his own animal and brought him to an inn and took care of him. And the next day he took out two denarii and gave them to the innkeeper, saying, Take care of him, and whatever more you spend, I will repay you when I come back. Which of these do you think provided to be the neighbor to the man who fell among the robbers? What was it that this man did that the others didn't do? The sacrifice of his own time, his own talents, and his own abilities. And I, I really believe that when we make it not about us, we can sacrifice of our time, our talents, and our abilities to help people uh, who are trying to walk out their Christian faith. And that's when it becomes about the kingdom. Which of these do you think pro proved to be the neighbor to the man who fell among the robbers? It, it, this whole story is prompted by the question, who is my neighbor? And Jesus, uh, I think that this uh, young ruler was looking for a list, a list of who his neighbors was. And what does Jesus tell him? He tells him what a good neighbor is. And then he says, go and be that good neighbor. And it is sacrificial to be that good neighbor. It's uh, using your time, your talents, and your abilities to be a good neighbor. He said to him, the last verse in 37, the one who showed him mercy. He wasn't even able to say the Samaritan. Um, and it's hard sometimes when you break people out of their molds uh, to categorize them as uh, selfless and uh, that's what we've got to do we've got to be thinking about being selfless towards other people it's an effort it takes our time our talents and our abilities so i would encourage you to be that good neighbor sacrificing of your time your talents and your abilities to benefit the kingdom uh, i just want to take a minute and thank you guys for watching uh, my name is bob benson and uh, thank you for it's not about you